Hi to Chaco. Those are all the players. I want to change light blue a little bit. No one's fighting yet. It's just all creeping. I will go over who has what hero in a bit. First. A player's forces are hounds yeah. under siege. Make it that big. Hello. A bit bigger is fine. You know, I'm not going to make this perfect because it's going to take forever for me to make this perfect. I'm going to make Imperius a little bit, a little bit, uh, you know, different. Like how how different? Like what like like this color? Make him a little bit grayish. That way, it looks different than Sonic. Uh, perfect guys. Perfect. Is this perfect? Forces are under attack. I think you guys are saying this is perfect. Uh, great. Now let's look at the. Uh, let's see. It seems everyone is playing their main race besides Happy. So I, yeah, they definitely chose the races. Only the hero is random, guys. Everyone has their main race besides Happy. Happy is Night Elf. Uh, we have a Warden here for Orc Worker. He's playing Orc, of course, with a war uh, Warden. We have uh, a Blood Mage and a Turtle for Foggy. Uh, Priestess of the Moon here for Sonic. We have uh, a Dreadlord for Imperius. So no Riverman, I think. This is beautiful uh, interaction here between these players. So Archer here takes a lot of damage. She's my god, but there's a moon moon juice here. Or uh, Foggy. This uh, this turtle, of course, does so much damage. Bla uh, nice flame, defensive flame strike. The uh, Blood Mage already level 3. The Priestess of the Moon just level 2. Are under and the turtle uh, is my good back. He does so much damage, guys. Turtles are like glass cannons. This uh, this Archer goes down. Another flame strike, but it does not hit anything. There's a sentry ward there by uh, Foggy. Foggy's a defensive sentry ward. But Archer does go down. But uh, this archer also dies, uh, maybe, maybe not yet, but maybe at some other time in the future. EPT set by Cash. Cash has a Dark Ranger and a Fire Lord, or the other way around. We have a, a Demon Hunter here for for Hawk. We have uh, the Warden. Oh, already mentioned that. Guys, did we already know what Dark Blue has? Also, a uh, Blood Mage for Dark Blue, who is uh, a Blade. Oh, the turtle is dead. No more infinite damage here for Foggy. And he's just trying to defend here with the archers against these huntresses. There goes another archer. We have a level 3 uh, priestess of the moon now. And oh, there's a pocket factory. A player's forces are under these attack. two, uh, these buildings taking a lot of damage. This priest of the moon is. Uh, we have a tinker. Did I mention that? I mentioned the pocket factory, but not the tinker here. So does everyone have an expansion? I think everyone has an expansion, right? Um, yeah, pretty much everyone has that expansion. There's like a natural expansion just right next to the base. So that's nice. Are there any more expansion spots on the map? Don't think so, right? I'm not sure. Did the Dreadlord do anything for Imperius? A player's force is Imperius, right? Attack. Yeah. So who's Dark Green? Dark Green is happy. He has a TC. No, and yeah, but he has a different hero. Oh, he has Blood Mage. So many Blood Mages this game. Hello. I think three people got Blood Mage first. Uh, Happy is asking for wood. No, Cash is asking for wood. And Happy is uh, saying sex. These, these heroes here are super low on hit points. The uh, building goes down. We have a... What is this? Food! Foggy buys some food and he summons more food. This makes me so hungry. This guy uh, summoning more food. We have a fight over here as well. The TC uh, for, of Happy fighting against this uh, level 4 Demon Hunter. Or for uh, what's the name? Hawk. Name Hawk. And there goes an archer. It looks pretty bad for Foggy. Is he just gonna lose this game early on against his great nemesis in FFA, also known as uh, you know? Let's make the name a bit bigger. Also known as Sonic. Is Sonic just the nemesis of uh, of Foggy in FFA? Is this is what what's happening here? It is dark. It's so dark. There's so many night elves in this game. It's, it might just stay dark permanently. Cash creeping some more. Well, uh, everyone is creeping some more. Quite a beautiful game. Let's see if anyone is doing some shitty tech. Well, Hawk is going for uh, air and tanks or something or flying machines. Uh, we have Happy going for. Uh, you know, you know, he's going for something. He has Ancient of Lords. He's going for bears. He might go something else as well later. We have Imperius here with the Keeper second now. He has all the uh, melee 
or uh, auras, but he's playing human, so these auras are so bad. <laughs> like Vampiric Aura and uh, Thorns Aura. He's not going anything yet. He's going to castle. We have in the teal, of course, it's Sonic. He's uh, done bullying. Uh, oh, actually, now, now we have Cash attacking Foggy. Foggy just keeps being under attack. Everyone is just farming Foggy for XP. Who knew that Foggy was the, the weak link here in the FFA? Who would have guessed that? Well, Cash, by the way, he is going to tier 3 as well. A double bestiary going Raiders for now. Foggy is just trying to stabilize. He also has double Angels of Lore going dry it. And uh, the food is still alive. We have uh, Angels of Lore. Seems like every Night Elf is just doing double Angels of Lore. Uh, every human is going for the Griffin Aviaries so far. Nice, maybe dark. Blade. Blade has three of the workshops and two Griffin Aviaries. And what about Orc Worker? What is he doing? He's uh, going Bestiaries. Torin. Okay, Torin here for Orc Worker. What a beautiful play there. We see uh, Sonic here walking across the map. Some grunt died somewhere. Oh, over here, of course. Uh, we have some more fighting and, another, and someone else also attacking Foggy. Everyone just killing Foggy. So far, uh, well, actually, this is Sonic again. Sonic, Cash, they're just making sure Foggy, uh, you know, doesn't win this game. These grunts, these grunts taking so much damage. Tinker is uh, doing just fine for now, but for how much longer? The Blood Mage is is still over there in the back he's almost level four but not quite he bears uh he has to defend here with the shredder while he's defending here with uh, everything else triads blood mage tinker tinkers and snared but uh banish saves him and cash retreats but now he has some bears here to take care of and they're getting this uh, expansion meanwhile over here cash has to retreat because blaze blaze is attacking his expansion and we have a purple yellow interaction over here which is uh, orc worker against hawk the blade master almost dies but here comes the warden Level one warden uh, for Orc Worker. <laughs> Wait, he has a Blade Master? A player's Orc Worker got a Blade Master. Hello. <laughs> and a warden. <laughs> it's random heroes, guys. Random heroes. We have a piggy here. It's such a dark piggy. Squillbees is. Uh, you know, we, we're fine with uh, Black Squillbees here. Yeah, they're pretty tasty as well. We have a uh, Mount King actually for Blade. Blood Mage and a Beast Master. Mount King takes a lot of damage from these towers. Uh, and he starts out the Mountain King, does he have the TP? Meanwhile, we have the Griffins attacking uh, Sonic over here. These bears take so much damage. The Dreadlord might have to TP out there in a moment. He starts him out instead, which is fine. Because meanwhile, we have tanks attacking here with the uh, Hawk with, with tanks and Griffins. Attacking Orc Worker. The Orc Worker doesn't give up easily. We have uh, uh, Archmage here for Hawk. Everyone is seemingly getting at least one of his, uh, one of their starting heroes, nor uh, one of the normal heroes. Uh, nice mana burn. These tanks are just killing Burrows. Burrows aren't that great against tanks if they have the armor upgrade. They die just faster against the tanks. And uh, a Wyvern went down. This fight did end. A player's I forces are under thought attack. it would. This fight also, you know, is over. So now it's just this fight here. It's uh, David Havka. Yeah, Hawka is probably Hawk. David, I'm not sure what it means, but uh, he's probably saying he's a cheeser, a tank cheeser. And then GG! Orc Worker is the first one to GG out, guys. And uh, it's not foggy, even though he's being attacked by 25 different people. It is Orc Worker who just, in one fell swoop, one Hawk attack, just GG's out. Meanwhile, have uh, Griffins here for Imperius. Griffins here for Imperius just uh, attacking. There's a Lich and a Dreadlord and a... What a heroes? Are you kidding me? Dreadlord first, Keeper second, Lich third. I feel like he probably got the worst heroes in the game. It's, uh... You know, there's this just this hero combination. <laughs> it's gone Griffins. The Griffins are 1-1. One, one. We have uh, Happy with some some Hippos, some Chimeras. Hawka is just getting his entire base because he wants to uh, build an expansion here, of course. And here as well. And meanwhile, we have an attack here. Attack of the blade on uh, on Cash. Knight takes so much damage from the towers. The towers are fortified armor. Here comes some tanks. They need to uh, do some damage. They're 2 2 upgraded. Here comes a Cash TP in. Not sure where he was at. Uh, he was actually. No, he only TPs in with half his army. He was over there. He was probably uh, doing something over here with uh, Foggy. But Foggy has stabilized. 
fuck he's back in the game it's not like orc worker he doesn't give up he is still in this game the uh, fire lord here has ankh he won't die anytime soon we have this beautiful fight here uh lava spawns oh lava spawn goes down the blade master is going down fast he's dead the moment uh we have some uh lull by the way i should probably remove orc worker from the overlay maybe uh there goes a the wyvern there's some tanks these tanks are going down super duper fast a beautiful flame oh here goes a foggy attack from the other side cash is now in trouble he's in deep shit he's being attacked from all sides this time it's foggy that is taking revenge here against cash and uh you know i think foggy sees there that uh blade is over there as well foggy's like okay i need to defend my own base let me defend this uh, base against sonic because that might be important you know uh, Dark Ranger level 3 has fallen. Uh, the Oh! Banished Stormbolt is, uh, of course, super powerful with mass Griffins. Hello! Beautiful uh, play here by Blade. He is just killing everything over here. And Cash also GG's out. And that's all the orcs, right? Are there more orcs? Well, no more orcs in this FFA. It's just human Night Elf. Just human Night Elf. There was no undead because Happy was playing as Night Elf. So, uh, probably losing a few buildings. There goes uh, Pocket Factory. Piggy, can he eat the piggy? The piggy is so tasty, of course, but maybe he doesn't go for it. Uh, the piggy goes down. That was still Orc Workers. Oh, okay, we have uh, Griffins here against the Hippos. The Hippos of Happy are just a perfect counter against the uh, Griffins, even though they have the armor, the Thorns Aura. Uh, so the Hippos kill themselves, but no. Piggy out. Griffin, Griffin is, uh, I mean, the Chimera, I mean, took a lot of damage. No, the Hippos, so super powerful against these, uh, these silly little air units here for uh, Imperius. They just died at some point. Here's another attack. Sonic again attacking uh, Foggy. He's been attacking Foggy all game long. I wonder what you guys see for uh, at the bottom right. Oh, yeah, that's not working. Uh, hippos are doing just fine in the air, doing nothing actually, but the bears are doing fine on the floor, on the ground, just killing everything in front of them. Uh, you know, this, uh, it was an expansion here for Blade, of course. Nice flame strike here on these bears. We have a super three, uh, three people fighting here as well. Happy in the middle. We have, uh, on the left we have Hawk attacking here with tanks. On the right we have, uh, Imperius with like mass air. Bears, a lot of bears are dying. And TP out here for Sonic. Dreadlord. Dreadlord here for uh Foggy. Dreadlord third. Oh, and here comes Blade. TP defense here. This is uh silly tanks. Doing over here, there's nothing over here. Nothing there. Is of lore. Is under siege. Oh, is she, whatever is under siege. Okay, so happy. No, cash. Cash is out. But maybe I can just. Wait, I have a great idea. Cash. Properties. Opacity. A player's forces are under attack. Opacity 27%. And orc worker as well. Isn't that, isn't that amazing? Amazing ID. I do this live on stream. I'm a professional streamer, guys. Actually, it's not a great siege. ID. Stat, I think I'm just going to delete them. Delete. Work workers out. Cash is out. There. Six players are still left. Six players. And we have another fight here. A nice uh, flame strike. Silence here. Uh, sleep. I mean, on the priestess of the moon, she's sleeping while the bears are fighting. Her aura is not very relevant. So everything is me melee here, and uh, bears against bears, hippos against nothing. It's uh, same here with the uh, well, the prepare or actually the opposite story. That's very relevant. The beastmaster surprise with the rejuvenation. These bears are, are fighting like uh, bears do. Priestess of the moon doing nothing. She's not sleeping even. She's just standing there doing nothing. Okay, she decides to do something again. Meanwhile, here comes an attack. 
maybe of uh, Blade on Sonic's base, not yet, as uh, Blade retreats. Sonic still has a few hippos, but I'm not sure if that's enough to uh, hold off Blade. Blade is going now for uh, Foggy's expansion instead. No, he doesn't, but he, he's so in the side in the side step. Yes, we will have an attack here between a uh, fight here between Happy and Imperius. Almost, he almost had a fight there. This uh, this twist of the moon is now level five. She's just uh, oh, we have a fight. We have a fight. Hippos here killing, or are they winning even? Do we have enough birdies? Uh, Dragonhawk riders to take care of the hippos. Everyone is 3 3 upgraded. Uh, it seems the hippos do overtake the, uh, the Dragonhawk riders. So there are towers here in the back defending here with the list up to the, the Dreadlord. You know, he's kind of useless. Maybe if he had the Orb of Fire, he would win the game. Imperius doesn't realize you can buy the best Orb in the game here for only 275 gold. They're fighting here, but oh, is Blade going to join this fight? This fight takes forever somehow. Uh, bears don't kill each other very fast. Uh, rejuvenation being used. This bear does go down. Oh, he is, by the way, at 35 supply. And uh, Sonic at 76. Wow. Beautiful fight. The, uh, the tanks going for this base of Foggy, though. Foggy it seems like he's finally going to die. Finally, this uh, two pronged attack here on Foggy is going to kill him. And. Uh, Pretty sad. He's probably the third one to die. It's a banish there on the blood mage. Blood mage with the orb of venom, of course, is really powerful. But not if you're dead. If you're dead, blood mage is kind of useless. Okay, blood mage just go down. The beast master level four is. Uh, he also has an orb of venom. Everyone has these orbs of venoms. Uh, let's look over here. So we have happy at 80 supply. Imperius at 80 supply. Uh, banish. On the, you know, this guy's dead. Banish Stomp is the beautiful combination there if you have Chimeras. The uh, TC takes a lot of uh, damage here from and loses mana from the Arcane Tower. They sleep on the Chimera. There's a few of these shackles, but the Dragon Hawks are just no no match for the Hippos. They're just out outnumbered. Meanwhile, uh, Foggy finally changes out. We have a fight here. All the Hippos here dying to the tanks. We have uh, five tanks just killing all the Hippos of Sonic. And Foggy is out of the tournament or out of this FFA. All the Dragon Hawks are going down pretty fast here. And, uh, it's, uh, you know, this is a beautiful game. Let me remove uh, Foggy. Foggy. How do I remove him? Remove. Foggy's out. So we're down to five players, guys. Five players. Imperius is uh, fighting. He's uh, fighting for his life. He's 34 supply. He's probably uh, going to be next. We have a fight here. What? Sonic. He lost his Beastmaster. Sonic. How much supply does Sonic have? 78. Where is his army? Here it is. wonder if he lost his Beastmaster to Creeps Kappa. We have almost a level 6 Priestess of the Moon. And that will help with the Cluster Rockets. He has Cluster Rockets, right? Did he have no, the Tinker? Tinker actually does. <laughs> he's dead. He didn't have cluster rockets. Uh, the bears here trying to kill this blood mage. Blood mage has an info potion though. The Priestess of the Moon is gonna hit level 6 here in a moment. The hippo is about to die. But the Mountain King, the Mountain King in trouble. It does he not have staff? He does have staff, but doesn't use on the Mountain King. Doesn't think that the Mountain King deserves to be uh, alive. There is the Starfall on all the units here. All the tanks, all the griffins taking so much damage. And a TP out, but the tanks are left behind to die to the Starfall. Well, Imperius lost his main, his castle. Happy uh, is over there. Looky, looky. We have a happy tree of life here in the, ba in the base of Imperius. Imperius is still in the game, but now he has a tree of life in his main base. Is under siege. And he has a phoenix defending it. A player's Some force book of the death attack. used here for Hawk. Uh, for scouting purposes? Is this a scouting book of the dead? Looks like it. Oh, Chimera's going to defend her. 3-3, of course, all the units here for uh, Hawk also 3-3. He has tanks, he has griffins, he has inner fire, he has a uh, demon hunter. Level 5, he has a uh, level 2 arguments. He has 4 bases though, so... So we have the two units on the left side, Blade and Hawk at four bases, which is uh, much more bases than anyone else in the game. The other players all have only uh, two bases. These uh, tanks, uh, beautiful, the storm doesn't hit mechanical units, uh, apparently. 
These uh, hippos go down so fast to the tanks. The flame strike kills the tanks though, but uh, it's just chimeras. They cannot attack air units, of course. There's a mana burn on the, the hero. Uh, Hawk is 87 supply. Happy is 64. Happy is not is not holding on. He is dying slowly. Is under siege. He is too much pressure on Happy. It's probably going to be between the two humans, Blade and Hawk, in the end of, the, uh, of this match, I think, because Imperius and Happy are very weak, and you know, so is Sonic actually. Sonic 59 supply, 49 for Imperius, and 65 for Happy. Well, we have uh, are under 98 supply for Hawk, and we have. 80 supply for uh, for Blade, and he's just staying under, under he's just staying under 80 supply because he wants more money. There goes another water metal. We see this beautiful fight here. Blade not expanding. I mean, he's not expanding there yet, but or is he? The militia are underway. Uh, these chimeras took so much damage. Happy GG is out. Happy is out. He is out before Imperius. Imperius probably happy that the Happy is out because that. Uh, that means he can live a little bit longer, but I'm not sure if he can make a comeback in this game. Happy out, we're down to four players. Sonic, Blade, and um, Hawk. Sonic fighting here against Blade. Blade, I mean, he has an 80 supply army, but this doesn't look like 80 supply. He doesn't even have the third attack upgrade on his Griffins. Hello, or his Knights, well, well the share uh, attack upgrades. This guy is dead, this bear. This bear also going down super fast. 80 supply, 57 supply for Sonic, of course. Oh, they're gonna fight. They're not. Bear is taking so much damage. There's a dead bear. We have a tank here with some fish. Where is uh, Blade's supply? Is it just peasants? So you just have supply and peasants. There's a tank stuck over there. Should probably kill his own farm. A town is under siege. Because he's building another town hall. He should still attack. be at the uh, available hundred supply. Oh, we have a fight here. We have dragon hawks. Uh shackling the griffins, of course. The tanks are killing the dragon hawks slowly. Some staffs being used. The lich is beautiful in the back. But uh, it seems the uh, hawks army is just so much bigger than Imperius's army. This year, oh, Hawk did go, Lizard went down. Hawk went down to 77 supply. Imperius is down to 45 supply. And here we have another fight with the uh, Phoenix as well helping the Hawks. The hippos here are also not enough. But there is, uh, there is Thing, Starfall. But she gets Stormbolted, Stormbolt, and she gets killed. Oh my god, that was the, the hero of the game. The Beastmaster goes down, Mount King goes down again. He doesn't feel any need to save any anyone. They just, uh, you know, has to stop just for, just because it looks good, just because it looks pretty. Doesn't feel like uh, he needs to use it. He actually has to retreat here. The biggies and the dries are just too strong for the blood mage and the griffins. And uh, the blood mage is, he did stop something finally. He has an expansion here building, expansion here up. So uh, he will have the most bases here in the moment. This one only has 2k. Not that important, actually. Yeah, we have a base available over there as well, of course. That was Happy's uh, old base that got killed. A little bit of gold here left, but uh, Imperius tries to mine it. Doesn't. Isn't very successful. Just trying to retag to keep. Tree of Eternity of Sonic finds the tunnel of Blade. Tries showing up as well. The 3 3. The Beastmaster, he's like. Okay, things are going down here. He now has Stampede as well. So Stampede and Starfall. What a beautiful combination. If you can get the... Visit of the Moon back. He's just hunting. The Beastmaster is hunting. Let's see his other units kill this. But we have uh, nothing special happening over here. Just, just nothing special. Beastmaster going for the next base. But this base already mined out. We have three mining bases for Blade. Well, uh, only two mining bases at the moment for uh, for Hawk. Yeah, well, we have all these guys, these, these Dragon Hawks just running past the tanks. They took so much damage already. I'm not sure if they can kill the Griffins in time before they die themselves. They are, they are outnumbering the Griffins, which is nice, but the tanks 
Uh, killing these dragon hawks is so fast. I'm not sure who has healing scrolls. We have a demon hunter with the healing scroll. We have the naga with the healing scroll. I'm not sure uh, if Imperius had any healing scrolls. I don't think so. Because his dragon hawks are all dead. This uh, keeper is also dead. This lich is still alive, but you know. For how long? For how much longer is this lich still alive? We have boots here on the naga. One shot and the lich is dead. I mean, not in one shot, but she would get slowed, or he would get slowed. Uh, the lich does survive. Dreadlord died at some point again. Uh, this base is also dying of blade. He played overextended. Maybe Sonic is just such an amazing player. He pushes Blade back. Blade will be down to two mining bases, and because of that, Hawk will be at three mining bases. He's building a third base. I feel like uh, Blade. Blade is losing against Sonic. I mean, he's not actually losing, but he's losing much more than he should have been losing against Sonic. I think he could have uh, handled that a bit better. And because of that, Hawk is getting the advantage this game. Blade only has one level seven. A seven. Oh, now the Mountain King is six. Seven, six, and four. What about Hawk? A town uh, is under siege. Oh. Six. Five and five? Six, five, and five. Okay, the hero levels are equal between those two players. Uh, there's always a chance a that one of the other players still attack. makes a comeback, but actually, I don't see Imperius making a comeback. Maybe Sonic can somehow still stay in this game. But he's losing a tree of eternity here, Upwood said. Is a single game cup? Yeah. Uh, there's another game I think next week. I'm not sure if how it's related to this game. I'm not sure uh, how it works. I'm not sure what the prize one is either. You can find it uh, on the website. We have the piggies. The piggy's so strong, of course. It's a lovely three piggy. Here comes the tanks. Tanks are great against uh, hippo uh, hippos, but there are only four hippos. This uh, griff uh, shredder goes down to the griffins. There's a fight here as well. Dragon hogs against tanks. But dragon hogs won't win this. The lich, uh, Retreating. There goes the hippo. There goes the piggy. Beastmaster is attacking air units, the uh, priestess of the moon. Going for this uh, beastmaster. He has a staff, but oh, beastmaster, hello. Maybe we shouldn't give him the info potion. I'm not sure where Blade's uh, Mount King is. Oh, there he is. He has an info potion on the Mount King. Should have given that info potion to this uh, beastmaster when he had the chance there, to, when he walked past the blood mage. Um, he's, this pocket factory is. That Mountain King is uh, actually Blood Mage and Mountain King are, are very vulnerable here. The tribes might just kill them in the end. Uh, he has an info potion still. Oh, Stormbolt on the Banished Tinker. He goes down in one Stormbolt. Uh, tanks here. Okay, he's just finishing off Imperius. Not that interesting. The Blood Mage stops out the, the Mountain King and he goes banished himself and tries to retreat. There's Dispel on the Banished. Tanks here killing the base over here. The Pieces of Moon defending. Is there? A, oh, there's a defense here of Imperius. Yes. Oh, we have a, a super demon hunter, but he's sleeping. Finally, the Dreadlord doing something useful. Uh, but all these, uh, yeah, I mean the Griffiths are all dying, so it will be just tanks and heroes for Hawk in a moment. Ah, ah. And uh, did the Blood Mage escape? I assume the Blood Mage escaped somewhere. Yeah, there he is. And uh, there's a mana burn on the Lich for 80. This is out of man. These heroes are still so low in levels. The Dreadlord here in the back, he's uh, he's level 5 now. So he sleeps. Is that level 3 sleep or level 2? Level 2 sleep still, but the next sleep will be level 3 sleep. Uh, the towers are dying slowly. What are these guys? Oh, they're just healing. Just healing. Meanwhile, over here, the tanks are still killing so many buildings. Sonic building an expansion over there. Killing the peasants over here. And um, Hawk is looking just... So nice. Hawk is at 72 supply and he has 8.5k gold. We have Blade uh, with 8k gold at 67 supply. I guess it all is depending on the. Uh, I mean, the biggest difference will be the heroes. So we have a. What do we have? Level 6 Demon Hunter, level 5 Archmage, level 5 Naga. I don't actually think these heroes are amazing for Hawk. Uh, well, here we have the level 6 or 7 Blood Mage or something. We have a level 5. Beastmaster, level six Mountain King, but I haven't really been impressed. Uh, by the way, how Blade has been uh, microing his heroes in these fights. 
This Lich is healing, so uh, he's dying faster than he's healing, so he's just dead. We have a Dreadlord and a Keeper just hunting down whatever they can. Are actually, they're being hunted attack. down. No orb still on this the Dreadlord. No orb of fire all game long. It's only 275 gold. And um, GG. Furious GG's out. So we're down to three players. No grid. Is there prize money? There's prize money. There's, um, there's just one game today, so... There's not, no, no grid. Okay, Furious. Yeah, we have the Hawk, Blade, and Sonic left. Oh, nice bash there. there. Ah, I definitely think these heroes are better than the heroes of Hawk. Oh, there goes the Keeper. The Demon Hunter is strong. The Naga is not that powerful. The Archmage is not very powerful either. Uh, maybe if he can get level 6 and mass teleport, he can uh, do base race style of play and kill expansions very easily. I'm not sure if he, he's gonna get level 6 in time. But here we have uh, Blood Mage. No, he can banish that. Uh, he can banish that level 6 Demon Hunter, Beastmaster, and Mount King. This base going down. What what does he have? Sonic has 19 supply left. He has uh, 19 supply. What is this? This is 9 and 5 is 14 supply over here. And then 5 supply. What's the other 5 supply that Sonic has? Are under attack. I'm not sure. Does he have a second hero or another hero somewhere? Or does he have 5 wisps? Oh, he has 5 wisps. So this is what Sonic has. 1 hero, 3 drives and 5 wisps. And someone Hawk's asking for a pause. Uh, the Dryad, I think that's what he's doing. <laughs> Mojno, Miniti, pause. No one is answering. Uh, he's asking the wrong people. And yeah, I'm not sure. This uh, gold mine. So, how many gold mines do we have running here? Hawk has two gold mines attack. running, and Blade has two gold mines running. Uh, but no, I'm not sure if that makes the biggest difference at this point. They both have uh, a lot of gold. Hawk has 10k gold with the 80 supply. And Blade is has eight and a half K gold. He's at 77 supply. Someone is using a review over here. I assume it's Hawk. Town is under siege. Town is under siege. Sonic is. I wonder if there's a prize money for second place. I wonder if Sonic can just you know stay in the game and get second place somehow by hiding buildings, because uh, you know. If that's the case. Oh, these dryads here. Ah, ah, two dryads die. He has one dryad left. He has a priestess, one dryad. And these wisps. And, uh, here comes Hawk. Hawk has five griffins and five tanks. And uh, a few priests and his heroes. We have Blade. He has uh, two tanks. He has a knight. Two knights. That's like uh, six dragon hawks and three... Griffins, thanks Imperius for the raid and the the host. Thanks. Here we see some shackles in a moment. Oh, the tanks do so much damage here against the dragon hogs. They have a level six demon hunter. Where is the banish on the demon hunter? We have the this guy. What is he called? The Phoenix. Thanks to so much. He needs to banish the demon hunter. What is he doing? And he needs to steal more mana or something. Uh, there's a banish. Okay, the mountain king is level seven as well uh, using the avatar. There's a mana burn on the beast master for eight. He could have, I guess he couldn't have mana burned the mountain king, but maybe the blood mage for it. No more banishes. It seems that Bla blade is retreating. Uh, there's too many uh, griffins oh, here and etc. Hawk is just playing this beautifully. Well, blade is uh, losing this, but blade can remax. We can remax with the super counter army. Oh, the Beastmaster is dead though. I'm not sure why he just lost the Beastmaster there. He did, did have his staff available. Finds the Priestess. Uh, tries to kill the Priestess. Is he doing all right? The Blood Mage is running. The town is okay, this uh, Priestess of the Moon is dead. Hello. Sonic down to four supply. He has four Wisps and one tree. Uh, Blade just got, uh, killing off Sonic. Oh, Sonic left the game just to make sure. I'm not sure if there's like second prize money, uh, but Sonic is out of the game now. He GG's out. Let me remove him from the overlay. Sonic. Great. 
So we just have Hawk and Blade left. Just have Hawk and Blade left. Blade. He did lose the last fight. That was pretty bad. He can remax. Uh, Hawk's also attack. going to 100 supply. But Blade definitely needs to win the next fight. He is definitely siege. behind. Even though I like his heroes better, it seems like... Um, I don't know, Hawk has been playing better this game. I feel like Hawk has been playing... I haven't seen any mistakes by Hawk. As much as I've seen uh, mistakes from Blade. Demon Hunter. Oh, he has the Orb of Fire! On the Demon Hunter is very strong, by the way. We always joke. Uh, I always say how Orb of Fire is the best orb. It's, of course, uh, jokingly. You know, sarcasm, etc. But on a Demon Hunter or a Blade Master, for that matter, anyone with high attack speed... This orb is actually uh, quite good, you know, because uh, you know you normally it's not that great for a human because the heroes for human have very low attack speed, so they're much better off with the orb like uh, orb of venom or orb of corruption, which is not a dependent on your attack speed. While an orb of lightning or the orb of uh, fire, they are they do more when if you have a higher attack speed, they're better. So. This orb isn't actually as bad. However, if you use this ultimate, of course, it's uh, it already does splash damage anyway. There's two parry ups here on both these heroes. He just doesn't want to lose his heroes. He's just been buying parry ups. That's what he buys at the shops. Okay, do we have an army yet for Blade? He has 82 supply. He's building an expansion over here. Where's his army? Where's Blade's army? Okay, over there. There's Griffins and tanks. These tanks, man. Is there no counter to tanks? Can't you just go mortar teams or something? Is that not something? He has more... Blade has more uh, griffins. He can easily kill the uh, other griffins off, I think. Even, well, I'm not sure. <laughs> I have no idea, guys. I've never seen a fight like this. Uh, except earlier in this game, then. We have uh, inner fire on these guys. So they have 40% uh, armor. Okay, nice TP out here by Hawk. Realizes he cannot win this fight. Besides, this is probably not his entire army. Probably has more units somewhere. Maybe. Okay, maybe not. Okay, maybe the boss is an entire army. We have uh, this mine still mining. This mine still mining. Uh, blades mining over here. We have uh, gold mines. I'm not sure how much is left in these gold mines. Pro especially this one, probably not that much. These were Foggy's gold mines. So, of course, <laughs> they're here. There was the most fighting over here, so of course these gold mines last the longest. We have this one also still um, with the a little bit of gold. Oh. 94 supply for Blade. 96 for Hawk. Hawk has more than twice the gold though over uh, uh, Blade. It's still more than 10k gold. You guys don't see it, but he has uh, 11k gold for Hawk. And we have uh, about 4.5k gold here for Blade. He's killing the stars pretty uh, efficiently. Here comes, here comes uh, Hawk though. The level 7 Demon Hunter. And a nice mana bird. Oh, there's no mana for Banish now. Or even Siphon mana, but it doesn't matter. Mount King TP's out. Mount King also has uh, parry up The items, by the way. I mentioned earlier how I like the hero level, uh, heroes here better for Blade. Uh, but the items. These heroes are all fully stacked on super items. Periaps, orbs of fires, info potions, healing scrolls. What does Blade have? Look, these heroes have nothing, like a staff, a staff and two periaps. And uh, this one has a few more items. Find some peasants over here. Rawr, rawr, rawr. Uh, another Griffin Phoenix. This Archmage, by the way, is level 6 now, so. Uh, he should be able to outmaneuver uh, Blade, maybe. Maybe. There's knight. 94 against 98 supply. Uh, this tank in the front takes a lot of damage, but uh, they don't take so much damage because they have uh, 8 armor, of course, fortified armor. This uh, knight just takes so much damage, that he he goes down fast. There's magic damage against heavy armor. Uh, tanks here against uh, the griffins. Much more griffins for blade, but much more tanks for uh, for 
Hawk. You see what is uh, stronger. It seems like the tanks are stronger. Griffins aren't. Uh, don't stand up against the tanks. These two Griffins are also just dying here. The other Griffins already killed. The demon they're fighting against the, the Avatar. Uh, Mount King is stealing mana. He has mana bird. He has mana for more uh, spell support like uh, Banish. The Demon Hunter is dead! Wow! Did, I thought... I, oh, he did he? Oh, for some reason I thought the Mountain King didn't have mana. The Blood Mage also dies. Uh, that's a mistake. I thought he had an Info Potion or something. Maybe he used it already. These tanks still fighting against these Griffins. Actually, these Griffins do survive. These tanks are going down. We have Mortar Teams here for Hawk. Sneaky Mortar Teams with Inner Fire killing these uh, tanks very efficiently. I feel like even... Uh, I feel like Hawk won the fight. Like 97... Against 37, yeah, look at the difference. GG AM, okay. GG, guys. And now we remove from the board, of course, Blade. Remove. Yes, and that means Hawk is the winner.